Hey everyone, welcome back and today we are going to discuss about uh, how to change the logo for a different portals. So whenever we are going to uh, use uh, your different portals in our application. So for each portal you want to have a logo, then how do we do this? Okay, so for this Pega is giving you an OTB, uh, OTB rule, uh, portal uh, navigation rule. So you need to open that first. <coughs> so to do that, first of all we will first launch uh, any portal from the uh, dev studio and from here you have a live UI so select the live UI and uh, See this is where our icon would be So open this layout. So when you open it, then it would be going to show you the portal navigation rule Okay, so this portal navigation rule is in my current rule set actually it was there in the themes cosmos Okay, so from there I have copied into uh, copied into the uh, current applications rule set. So what I'm going to do now. So in this, this is the icon where you are going to, you can see your application logo here. Okay. So whenever I see in the user portal, I don't have any application uh, logo over here because I have done already uh, changes. So that's the reason it is not showing, but I'll tell you what it is, how it is. So now I, what I want to do is based upon the portal, uh, I need to change different logos. So how do we do that? But before that, we need to understand where exactly the portal is configured. Our portal is configured in the access group, right? right? When you open your access group, group in your access group, your portals are available. And for this particular operator, developer is the uh, portal. So how do I know the developer, uh, where this developer portal is uh, assigned to, to which property it is assigned to? So if you go to clipboard, in clipboard, you have system pages. In system pages, you can see an access group over here. So in this access group, you will see PY portal property where the portal uh, will be portal value will be stored. Yes. So as I selected the developer and you can even see here that PY portal is developer. Now, according to this, uh, what you understood is your portal values will be there in the PY portal property. So that is our uh, uh, value. now. So with, with this, you can make sure to which portal you want to show the logos. Okay, so as I said in portal navigation, you have um, icon, right? Uh, the one application logo here, right? So I, what I'm doing is I am doing some visibility condition over there. So in this visibility condition, I'm adding here like this access group dot PY portal is equal to equal to trainer. Whenever the portal, whenever you have PY portal as trainer, then only you show this uh, logo. What is that logo? Application dot PY logo references. You show that. Okay, but if it is not trainer, if it is some user portal, then how do you do that? What I have done here is, I just copied this, copied and pasted another another image over here. So this is the another image. So in this, I have written some other, some other uh, uh, condition like access group uh, dot PY portal is equal to user portal. And I've used different uh, icon over here. Okay, so the different icon which I have opened. So icon class and uh, this is, I'm using some some other thing which here. So I'm using some building over here. So that would be shown on your uh, screen. Okay. As a logo. So now uh, for this current user, what is the PY portal? It is a developer. So that's the reason you cannot see any logo over here. Okay. So that is the reason, main reason for not seeing any logo for this operator. So for that to give a uh, demo for you, so I have two operators uh, taken. So one operator is operator3 at gmail.com where it is referencing to training user. In this training users, the portal name is user portal. So for this, I have a different logo. And in the same way for operator one, I have a, another uh, access group like training trainers. And in this, uh, the available portal is trainer. So PY portal here, it's trainer. And for that PV portal, it is user portal. So let me log off from here and log in with the operator one. When you log off and log in with operator one, you can see uh, for operator one, uh, it is Pega now. When means the logo is showing as Pega. Okay, so now let me log off and log in with the operator three now. So operator three means it's a trainer uh, access group. That means PV portal would be trainer. And if you see, logo is changed. I took a building as I said, right? So it's a building. 
So this is how you chain logo based upon the portal. So you have to have the PV portal.